Well, hi. I am so glad you made it, you know. I was waiting you when you were coming back to see me. Well, we're having tea today, and today we're going to talk about black teas. Yes, salons. We're going to go to the country. Come, sit down. Join me. Let's have a cup of tea in my beautiful non-GMO sustainable tea bags. This is Miriam at the Tea Salon here at 235th Avenue, and we are excited launching our tea bags, 100 count in a bag. Also, we're going to be doing it in canisters. That's right, 20 in a canister, recyclable material that you can buy 20 of them in. Isn't it great? Yeah, we're really excited. So I'm going to sit back here and have a cup of tea with you and talk about some of our black teas. Now, we've taken the tea from Sri Lanka, the island off India. We brought it up north and we started blending. I took my perfume nose and I made it just fabulous. Our tea we're going to talk about today is Chelsea Chai. Now, Chai means tea, you know, in most countries. Cup of chai, cup of chai. So today we took our Chelsea Chai. You know, our store used to be in Chelsea Market and also at 11 East 20th for 10 years in the Chelsea District. So it was not difficult to come up with the word Chelsea Chai. That's where it came from. And I took Ceylon, we're now the island off Sri Lanka. I took Assam in the north, the engine of English breakfast. I pulled them together, added some ginger, some cardamom, some black peppercorns, some white peppercorns, and I pulled it all together and added a hint of chocolate. So just a little hint, just to make it sweet to the mouth and delicious with a spot of milk. That's one of the great teas that we put into our tea bags. That's one. Sunrise in Tibet, a black salon tea, again, we're in the island off Sri Lanka. We brought it up north and we fragranced it and blended with a little vanilla, a little cocoa, a little chocolate. Wow! And a hint of mandarin orange and a little red thistle that you can see. So I think we should take a look at that tea because that's one of my fun teas. This is Sunrise in Tibet. Isn't that lovely? Rich, black, loves a spot of milk and loves the morning called Sunrise in Tibet. I brought it when I went to see the Dalai Lama years ago in New Delhi, and you know, he told me, <laughs> the truth is, he doesn't drink tea. 